So I was talking about this idea of a heavenly mother with a heavenly father. Uh, somebody had said something to me that if there is a heavenly father, there surely must be a heavenly mother. This came up because I um, joke that I'm trying to lure God so that I can be his wife because he's the only one good enough for me. <laughs> and that I think I'm good enough for God. I have a grandiosity disorder with my bipolar disorder. Sometimes I think I am God, and other times I think I will be God's wife. And I spend my time, when I'm alone, talking to God and talking to dead people. Um, I talk to atoms in the air, molecules, I address things to planets and stars. Um, I talk to anything because I believe that all objects have conscious awareness. We are all made of atoms and I believe atoms hold intelligence. And so I don't want to be caught when I die at the gates of heaven having been inconsiderate of any life. So I consider all things to be alive, mostly because in my schizophrenic disorder, I see faces in everything. And so to me, that's the personality of the object. If there is a face in it, there must be a spirit there or a conscious awareness. So that's why I spend so much time talking out loud to myself because I'm not talking to myself in my mind. I'm talking to the personalities of the atoms and the conglomerates of the atoms around me. But my neighbors don't like it and they call the police on me a lot for talking to myself in my garage. Of course, at one point I was yelling at dead people for being stuck in my driveway because I could all see their faces like on my driveway. And so I was yelling at them to quit acting like they were stuck in my driveway. I guess that can be an alarming situation for a neighbor. But overall, I think they called the police on me probably five times for strange behavior talking to myself. So that's the explanation for how I was committed and why. Because I talk to the atoms in the atmosphere and dead people and God.